Harry George with the Inland Valley News reporting from Palm Desert on a beautiful Sunday afternoon for the Anthony Anderson Golf Celebration. Let's update us what's been going on with your life. Sure. Black, Lish, Black Ish has been a fantastic, uh, I think you guys over a hundred episodes? Yep. we crossed a hundred last year. Wow, yeah. how fantastic is that? It is amazing. It's amazing. I feel, you know, at once so thrilled to have a job as an actor, but also so, so proud of the show. I mean, for what it does and the far-reaching effects it has. And they're spinning off the show to another one where the mom, Rainbow, played by Tracy Ellis Ross, is called Mixed Ish. So sure, it'll be two other inceptions of our show. I mean, it's a simple, but really, the success of the show, the secret sauce, is in how well the writers bring to life any issue, any topic, and with great gravity, but also with great comedy. And that's a, it's a hard thing to do, and they do it episode in, episode out. Through television, you guys are changing the dynamics of the way people think, especially on controversial issues. What's been the most impactful one episode that you think has made an impact or a change? Well, I would love to think that that Lemons episode made a change. The N-word one that Kenya wrote about just the very use of that word and how it comes to us, where it's used, was incredible. Um, you know, it's interesting what you said, that, that this show has this impact, because, you know, it's rare to be on a show that actually deals with issues. I mean, the template for us is Norman Lear. If you think back to All in the Family, where he was actually grappling, using comedy, but grappling with major social issues. When Kenya and Anthony went out to create the show, that was what they were aiming for. And by virtue of the fact of our success, you can see that they hit that mark. I mean, because there is no topic they won't go after, and I love their ability to make fun of themselves. No one laughs at themselves. Look at Dion Cole's character in The Office. We have so much fun with him because he is this foible for everything that is funky and weird about the culture, and they're willing to poke fun at themselves, which to me lends great gravitas to when they really do go after something. It's not just always on a soapbox. But it's a very three-dimensional look at these issues. And that's what's so successful about it. It's so relatable. It's so relatable how it's written. How has it launched your career even higher? Uh, it hasn't. I love this job. I I, uh, I do movies and I'm about to start a movie, but I don't want to you know, go any higher than this. If we went on for another 10 years, I'd be so happy, dude. I love this job. I'm not looking to do anything else than to continue to hit this out of the park. I'm so happy and proud to be in this moment, in this time right now. And I keep my head down because in case I, it gets above the, the parapet and God hits me with a sniper bullet, you know? Oh, right. Well, give one more big shout out for the Anthony event. Anthony Anderson, Family Foundation Golf Event. Amazing, big horn. Come out, celebrate.